Good evening, everyone. My name is Steve Pritikaris. I'm the Executive Director of Music Mission San Francisco. Standing to my left is Margaret Gonzalez. She's the Founder and Artistic Director. So, I have a... Uh, I'm going to say a few words before we get started, and then Margaret will follow me. And I uh, apologize, I have my notes, but I really wanted to make sure I didn't leave any of my thoughts out. So, here we go. Okay, approximately two years ago, Margaret and I, I mean, she was working in an L System inspired music program in Stockton, California. Uh, we first met through collaborations between that program and the University of the Pacific, where I teach music. As our friendship grew, I learned more about her personal story and the desire to open her own El Sistema inspired music program. It's always been my desire to spread the joy of music to places with limited opportunities. So when she told me she wanted to open a program here at the Mission Cultural Center, I knew it was something I wanted to be a part of. After a year of planning, we opened this past October, and now here we are ready to present our first concert. from the past. So in 1979, that's when I was in college, uh, I was in a marching band, University March Band, we were invited to spend two weeks in Venezuela. It was at that time that I truly came to appreciate the beauty of the country, the people, and the culture. That's also where I learned that Latinos have rhythm. <laughs> All right, that's my one joke for tonight. To this day, that trip remains one of the highlights of my life. Venezuela and Venezuelans have a special place in my heart. When I first learned of a Venezuelan music program called El Sistema spreading worldwide, I knew it would be special. Following the El Sistema philosophy, our mission here is to develop musical skills, cognitive and social skills, self-esteem, and pride that will inspire these children to become better citizens of the world. Studies have shown this type of program will improve academic achievement, behavior, school attendance, self-confidence, focus, and discipline, just to name a few of the many positive outcomes. Music has taken me all over the world, and it's brought me to this place on this very special night. The opportunities provided through music are infinite, and I can't wait to see where it takes the children of Music Mission in San Francisco. In the past few months, I've met many wonderful children and their families. This is the start of a beautiful thing here at the Mission Cultural Center. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
Okay, and I'm going to just introduce a few uh, special guests that we have here this evening, and I'll apologize up front if I mispronounce your last name. Uh, from U.S. Bank, Michael Millman. Symphony is Jeff Von Saul here. You. You're supposed to be over here in the reserve seat. Uh, is uh, Brian Newton here? Brian Newton, there he is. Brian Newton. He's, he's on the advisory board for Music Mission San Francisco. And then the executive director of the Mission Cultural Center for Latino Arts, Jenny Rodriguez. She wants to say a few words. Good evening, buenas tardes. Bueno, han hablado en inglés, así que quiero hablar un poquito en español, porque sé que habemos bastante padres aquí que hablan español. Así que, uh, Bienvenidos, nos sentimos muy orgullosos y muy contentos de darles la bienvenida a ustedes a este primer mini concierto del grupo de Mission Music San Francisco. Parece increíble que la conversación que tuvimos hace unos meses atrás, pienso que fue en marzo, eh, llegara a este día, a este logro que hemos tenido. Eh, les queremos dar las gracias naturalmente a Steve y a Margaret que son fantásticos músicos dedicados a nuestra juventud no vamos a hablar hoy sobre el valor intrínseco de las artes y del poder de las artes y de la música porque todos lo sabemos y lo vamos a probar pero es parte de nuestra misión desarrollar y promover el arte y las artes latinas Así que nos sentimos muy orgullosos. Les damos las gracias a ellos, les damos las gracias naturalmente a, a todos los otros músicos que están cooperando. Les damos las gracias naturalmente a los jovencitos que están haciendo su esfuerzo. Pero más que nada, porque soy la madre de dos músicos, le digo la importancia de la decisión que ustedes han tomado de apoyar a sus hijos porque sabemos que es un sacrificio tener que levantarse y llevarlos y traerlos y asegurarse de que coman y de que estén calientitos y todos y vengan a tomar la clase pero son ustedes el motor que inicia este proceso porque del mismo modo que los llevamos a jugar soccer o pelota o lo que sea y esas cosas se tienen que empezar a tiempo la instrucción musical se tiene que empezar a tiempo también y este es el momento preciso para que ellos lo hagan así que yo a los padres les doy Muchas gracias por el aliento que le están dando a los jóvenes y van a ver como dentro de un tiempo van a tener aquí un grupo del cual todos vamos a estar orgullosos porque van a ser nuestros embajadores musicales. Así que sin nada más los dejo acá y por favor continúen apoyando. Les deseamos lo mejor de estas fiestas navideñas y del año que viene, del 2016, que sea muy próspero para todos nosotros. Sabemos que estamos teniendo problemas en nuestra misión desplazamiento, artistas que se tienen que ir, etcétera, pero con más razón tenemos que apoyar las artes, porque es lo que va a mejorar nuestra calidad de vida así que muchas gracias y un placer y continúen apoyando este proyecto, muchas gracias I'll ask her a little bit later what she said <laughs> Okay, uh, just a reminder, please, uh, no flash photography while the children are performing. It can blind them and then they can't read the music. So uh, we will, at the very end of the program, have an opportunity for everyone to do, we'll have a group photo, so if you want to take pictures of the entire group, we can do that at the very end. Thank 
please welcome the students of Music Mission San Francisco. Thank you. 
Okay, we're going to see if you recognize this next tune.
So there are a lot of people to thank here, but I'm going to try and not make this sound like the Academy Awards. <laughs> Now, there were two organizations that were really critical for us to get this program off the ground. Uh, obviously, you have to have a facility to perform them. Uh, so the first was the Mission Cultural Center for Latino Arts. They've been really supportive, and so a big thank you to Jenny, uh, Leticia, Delphia, Adrian, and the rest of the staff here. Thank you very much. So we had our facility, and then we had to have instruments. And you know, you can go out and, and try and put together a, a violin here and there, and, and maybe the quality is, is good, maybe it's not. But uh, there's a fantastic organization, foundation here in town called the Open Street Foundation, providing instruments to four El Sistema inspired music programs in the Bay Area, one in Alameda, Alameda Daily, Daily City, Marin, and uh, our program here. And so uh, that's what they do, is they find instruments, part of their mission is to provide instruments to uh, your brother's children, and we are so grateful. So Lucien, thank you so much. <laughs> Where's Marcel? He's in the very background. Just a thank you to him. Uh, he, he helped Margaret. He and Margaret put together our fantastic looking website. If you haven't been to it, I encourage you to go there. But thank you so much for the hours that he spent with Margaret doing our website. Probably <laughs> over here doing photography for us. He's uh, got some wonderful pictures that have been on the website and other places. Thank you so much, Bradley. Adrian uh, in the back there, right? Uh, he has also done some fantastic pictures for us. Yeah, yeah, Thank you, Adrian. Yeah. I'd like to thank uh, the wonderful professional musicians that came in and performed with us today. Uh, Misha on cello over here. Yeah. And Mary on harp. She has been coming in on Fridays, volunteering her time to help with the rehearsals to get to this point. So we thank her extra, extra <laughs> uh, To uh, Brian Nugent, who I introduced earlier, advisory board member, some great support and advice. And we thank you very much, Brian. Another advisory board member, his name is David Shane. Actually, he was living in Marin County until just this past summer. He's living in Ohio now, but he still wanted to be involved with this program. He's done an incredible amount, incredible amount of work for us, and we're so thankful for him. So I wanted to make sure I mentioned his name, David Shane. Uh, parents and families of the program, we thank you so much. Especially those of you that have been bringing snacks for the kids every, every Wednesday and Friday, thank you so much for that. Uh, and to the children of our program. Thank you for bringing joy to our lives. I want to thank Margaret for her ideas, tireless effort, and wonderful teaching. When we started looking at the, uh, the registration of tickets for this program, and it started to increase more and more and more, and because we'd started, oh, we're going to have a reception, and then we started thinking, oh no, what are we going to do about food and drink? And we have some wonderful people here that came for, they actually have a child in the program, and it's uh, Louise over here with DeMay's Catering.
concert. You can thank them for it. And uh, they're going to be opening a restaurant up soon, uh, not uh, sometime this spring. So we will keep you uh, posted on when that happens. And we want you to go and support that because it's been amazing what they've provided us just for tonight. So thank you. Again. And then two new developments I want to tell you about. Uh, one is that uh, we're looking at expanding our program with, uh, there's a nonprofit called Mission Graduates Extended Day Program over at Marshall Elementary, and they'd like us to come over and start a satellite program over there. So uh, besides having a program here, we would go there and possibly some other elementary schools. And we have Natalie from Mission Graduates. Where are you at, Natalie? Natalie, there she is back there. So thank you, Natalie. And then the last announcement is, uh, so we have Jeff here from the Marin Symphony, that's a fully professional orchestra, and they have agreed uh, to bring in, you know, they get guest artists, uh, nationally and internationally recognized guest artists that come in and perform with their orchestra, and when they come in, they're gonna actually bring those guest artists over here to perform for our kids. So thank you so much, Jeff, and the Marin Symphony. Bells and uh, I intentionally in the program put the lyrics in case you forgot them. So there's no excuse for no singing on this one. Now we're not going to start at the very beginning, but I will turn around and give you a nice big cue when we want you to start. So thank you very much. Excited. We encourage you, uh, we do have the insert in the program uh, for donations. That, uh, that you can either give it to me or to Margaret, or we do have a little green box out in the lobby. Uh, or if you go home and you think about it later on, 
uh, you can go online and donate. So anything you like what we're doing here, we want to give these kids more, and we want to offer more uh, kids in the mission an opportunity like this. So if you're feeling it, will be greatly uh, appreciated by us. So, okay, we're gonna take a group photo up here. If anyone, you can just from your seats take your picture. We've got the teachers back here and we'll just do a group photo once. Okay, so we do have a reception now, and you're welcome to, uh, if it gets a little crowded in the lobby, you can actually come back in the theater to uh, the reception. So uh, we ask that you don't, please don't come on stage or backstage. We want the kids to get the instruments put away, and then they'll come back out here. So. And one more thing, you know, please go on Facebook and like us. Okay. Thank you very much. We'll see you at the reception. Thank you.